Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're doing well. So today I would like to share with you my nine month experience in taking anti-aging supplements. And if you're new here, welcome. I do a variety of videos that are related to skincare and health with a DIY approach, kind of, you know, into biohacking and self-experimentation. And today I want to share a different side of things that I think is much more important than the superficial stuff that I do share a lot of things on related to skincare. I think this is much more important because it's related to health. And if you're completely new here and like you don't know anything that I'm talking about when it comes to anti-aging supplements, I'm going to put some resources below and I can also do another video that actually explains the science briefly but also very specifically so that you get a better understanding of what I'm talking about. But uh, if I could explain it very, very briefly, I'll just say that there is a coenzyme in the body called NAD, nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide. Like I said, I'm gonna to refer to it as NAD. It is critical to multiple metabolic processes in the body. It is very important. And as we get older, our levels decline. Also, as people suffer from different health conditions, the levels can also decline. When you're younger, it's much higher, you're healthier, you're vibrant, you have energy stuff like that, but when you get older and it declines, it comes with like the adverse effect of negative health conditions and aging-related illnesses cropping up and occurring. So as a way to try to prevent some of those aging-related illnesses, some people choose to take supplements that are precursors to NAD in order to boost their levels of NAD in the body. And so the two most popular precursors are nicotinamide riboside, NR, and nicotinamide mononucleotide, or NMN. As of right now, NR has been studied more in humans, but a lot of people want to take NMN, and I personally just think it's because David Sinclair, a very, very popular scientist who has made NMN very popular, uh, I think that's why NMN is the one that people are searching for all the time, trying to find a good reputable seller or, you know, just trying to find that product to take. And it's difficult because it can be really pricey. And for me, I've kind of gone down a different route where I'm taking NR from what I believe is a very reputable company. And I like what I'm taking because of how my experience has gone with it, but I'm still open-minded with trying to see if there's a NMN product out there at the right price and if it's the right product, if it really is safe to take. So that has been studied less and there's just smaller companies cropping up selling it and many of which are from China. So I'm not gonna get all into that right now. I just wanna tell you guys that I actually filmed this video yesterday and I messed up the whole beginning part of it, had some technical difficulties. So that's why I am here today filming this part just to you know, give you an introduction into the rest of the video. So right after this, I'm gonna start and jump right into my actual experience because I just wanna share it with you guys. And I would love to hear from you in the comments section if you're taking any of these supplements and what your experiences have been so far. So that's what this video is about. Now we're gonna get into the part where I share my actual experience. So I'm gonna put the dates here uh, as to when I started nicotinamide riboside and how much I was taking at the time because I can't exactly remember offhand. All I can tell you is like right now, the amount I'm taking is much more significant than the amount I started taking about nine months ago. So I just wanna share with you how it felt in my overall experience and something that I would recommend. Um, obviously check with your doctor, whatever you do is at your own risk. Safety disclaimer, health disclaimer below, be safe and everything. But for me personally, when starting a new supplement, I think it's important to test it out. And for that reason, I personally have like empty gelatin pill capsules in my house. So what I'll do is I'll take a pill capsule, I'll open up the NR and pour a little bit in it. That's what I did when I really, when I started this supplement from the very beginning, because for me, I sometimes have a profound reaction to supplements and other times I've had allergic reactions. One time I had like practically, um, projectile vomiting from a supplement and a rash all over my face, not from these supplements, from something else. So I poured a little bit of the NR from Thorn and I took that supplement. And you know what, you guys, that was my very first time taking it. I felt so much energy. I cannot tell you 
how much, I mean, I looked like I was dying before I took it. I had such a lack of energy and I took this. I felt energy like I have never ever felt before. I know there's gonna be skeptics out there who are gonna tell me that what I experienced was a placebo effect. Thank you for your opinion on that. Uh, I wish I could create that type of effect on myself with every single supplement. Um, here's the deal, when it came to me taking NR, I just wanna share one other thing is that I have a, a good friend who has been taking three forms of B3. He's been taking uh, NR, NMN, and then a different form of B3 for at least a few years now for the purpose of anti-aging. He's been really into this stuff for years. And he told me about his experience. He's taking it for his health. He's feeling nothing from it, but he knows that it is benefiting his health, he's hoping. Uh, based on the current research and ongoing scientific research. So that's most of what I knew of the supplement before I began taking it. I never thought of it as this is going to give me a surge of energy like I never had before in my life. Basically, I'm saying I didn't expect to have energy. So I just wanna say not everybody's going to experience energy. Everybody has a different baseline of how much energy they have so many complicated things that I don't even have the knowledge of as to why I have such a great lack of energy. But uh, I don't wanna get too much into my personal health, but I will say that I've been diagnosed with multiple sleep disorders, and I also have Hashimoto's hypothyroidism, which is treated, so I should technically be fine from that. And I've also done some other at-home tests that have shown that I have low cortisol levels, which could be why I'm so tired. What causes that, the details behind that, how to fix it, it's difficult. That's for a different, different day. Uh, and maybe you guys have some information. Basically, I felt so much energy from the NR that I was taking, and then I slowly, slowly like increased the amount. I do remember reading a review on Amazon where a person said that they felt such a stimulant type feeling from that supplement or a different related supplement of NR or NMN that she quit taking it. And that is so unfortunate because I've heard experts say that if you do feel a very strong reaction to certain supplement or medication, it's usually because your body really, really needs it. I don't know the truth behind this and I don't know the science behind why that is. I would love to understand that more, but I find that to be true in my own experiences. And so I wish people would be warned, you know, start out really, really slow. That's what I did and that's how the first month probably went. It took me a long time to the point where I could even take a half a pill capsule. I felt so great though, you guys. So much energy, not a caffeine type of energy, just something that felt like I was alive, like I felt so healthy that I have never felt that in, I don't remember ever feeling like that my entire life. And that was the greatest thing I have ever experienced in a long time. So you guys, I feel like I almost went through a midlife crisis of sorts in between having so many months of such fresh energy of feeling so good, like top of my game, feeling the best I've felt in years that I was a little bit reckless. I ended up signing up for college, a college that is just hours away from where I live, thinking somehow I could manage that. Uh, and then things kind of took a turn because of the virus and the global pandemic, you know, kind of changed my plans. But besides that, the amount of energy I felt, it has gone down. I can't maintain feeling like a million bucks forever. I wish I could because I would do anything to feel that great all the time. Holy cow, you guys. Uh, so I don't want to get people's hopes up because like I said, I had so little energy to begin with that this is just like, the greatest discovery ever. And it could be like the same amount of normal energy that a regular regular person has. Uh, like my sister, for example, she seems to be going, going, going all the time, exercising, doing things, having so much life and energy. And she doesn't have like chronic conditions like a lot of people have, like chronic autoimmune disorder or something. Uh, so the amount of energy that I felt from it could be like a normal baseline for someone else. I don't know, but I just wanted to share that. And so, since then, I've slowly increased the amount I'm taking and now I'm taking usually two, sometimes three pill capsules. Also, I'd like to share that I do take breaks from it. And a couple of times I took breaks because I thought the, like, oh, this is kind of expensive. Do I, should I buy it again? But like, I have been buying it repeatedly. Amazon, I have some personal issues with Amazon. I'll still buy from them, but lately, if I can purchase directly from the company instead, I've been doing that. I'm gonna be placing an order 
from Thorn Labs themselves, but I did place an order on Amazon and it's taking three weeks to get to my house, my NR order. So I've been waiting, waiting, waiting. So like I said, there have been periods where I've been off of it for weeks at a time. I don't like to be off of it for that long, but I do think it's good for your body to take breaks. So besides that, I need to say one last thing because I am going on and on so much. I'm still feeling energy from it. Sometimes like if I take more, I feel a lot better and I get just amazing sleep when I take like three pill capsules, for example. And the good thing for me is that I can stop taking it then for like three days afterwards and I kind of feel like I still feel it in my system. I don't feel it like caffeine, like I said, but I still feel fine, like I still feel pretty great. So I'm fine taking a break for like three days and then taking it again. And a big part of me doing that is due to, uh, because, the, because it's a bit pricey. So that's how I'm doing it. And besides that, the other supplement that I did try, I tried one brand of NMN. This is from Infinite Age. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. The company contacted me and uh, offered this to me and I accepted it. I have never accepted anything from a company before this and I really wanted to try it and also save money. So that's why I accepted it. It says that they are certified for their purity, third-party lab tested, all that sounds good. At the time when they gave this to me, they were not on Amazon, I think, and now they are and they have a bunch of good reviews. A couple of people are questioning the legitimacy of it. I took this stuff over a period of months, slowly, one at a time, one, one a day. The only thing is, you guys, I don't know what to say about it. I hope that it is as pure as it says. I hope that it's a good product. The price is good compared to other ones that are out there. I think this is an option for people. I just don't know what to say because some people are questioning questioning it and I just haven't researched it enough. It's hard to know the truth with different supplements. But uh, with this one, I don't know, I'm on the fence. Have you guys tried this? Have you tried any other NMN brands that you would like to share in the comment section below? There's a couple things I'd like to say. Whenever I take NR or NMN, for some people, this only happens in the beginning when you start taking it. For me, I always tend to notice this is that it makes me feel like I have an increased appetite, sometimes like a very hungry appetite, strong feeling of being hungry. And other times I don't notice it. Sometimes I have to take a few of the capsules to feel it. But anytime that I took this, I never had that. So that was interesting. A positive thing about the Thorn one is that it includes resveratrol in it and a small dose of TMG. The TMG is supposed to help with methylation and I don't wanna get into that because I don't even know how to explain that very well right now, but I'll put something up on the screen to explain what it is, but it's still very complicated. If you're ever super, super concerned about methylation, I do know that you can get it tested for about 100, 70 to $100 out of pocket without your primary doctor getting involved. You can order the test online and go somewhere and get it done. If anybody wants to know how to do that, just ask me and I'll share it below. Because I've done that before, and due to me doing that before, it seems like it is kind of hard to mess with your methylation. Uh, but I guess if you're taking massive amounts of certain supplements, that could happen if you're not balancing things out properly. So one way I was balancing things out was I was taking B12 and a folate supplement, and also sometimes I would take TMG. But also, the supplement that I was taking by Thorn includes TMG in it, which is supposed to be helpful. Even if it's a small amount, it's better than nothing. So you guys, I'm rambling a lot. I really wanted to give this update. I really am into hacking my own health, doing tests at home, paying for tests out of pocket, doing different things, experiments. I love doing this stuff. And anything that can help improve my health, I'm all about it. And of course, I would wanna share that with others who have issues with fatigue or just are interested in longevity in general. So I hope this was helpful, me sharing my experience of nine months on these types of supplements, mostly the NR, but for a couple of months, I slowly got through this, uh, this supplement as well. So if you guys have any thoughts or questions or suggestions, please leave it in the comment section below. I really, really appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much and take care.